Are art lines useless? I think you'll hear a lot of opinions about this study. It's a pretty high quality study. You can't really blind this study, but it's ICU patients, a thousand of them randomized to either non-invasive blood pressure cuff or art line in the ICU. And the headline news is no change at all, identical mortality. And so the argument might be, why would you use invasive therapy when non-invasive is just as good? But there's a few things that you might want to think about here. Number one, just patient comfort. If you were in the ICU, would you want a blood pressure cuff going off every 10, 15 minutes all night long? It might be hard to get good sleep. You might ultimately see delirium dis discomfort. And how harmful is a radial art line if you use an ultrasound and if you use lidocaine when you're putting it, it in? So ultimately, I think we need to talk to patients more about which one they might prefer. I would also be a little bit concerned extrapolating to the emergency environment. The ICU gets the sickest patients for sure, but not necessarily the most unstable. In the emergency department, we're on a roller coaster. I can't get a blood pressure sometimes. My sat probe doesn't read because there is no pulse. And so I think art lines might have more value in the emergency department than they do in the ICU. If you want to hear more about this paper, tune in to the Boomdocs podcast, and I'll catch you next time.